this is the hard thing in the morning, choosing an outfit. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jaden Turner and for today's video I'm gonna be bringing you guys along with me for my senior year in college. It is my second day of school I have three classes in person and three classes online and Yeah, I've never been on campus. It is my third year in college and this is my first time being on campus Well, technically second time since it's my second day, but let's not get into the technicalities But long story short you guys welcome back Welcome back to a new video Welcome back. And I am sweaty right now under this sweater because I was nervous making this intro because I haven't filmed in so long. <laughs> How do you get nervous making an intro? You're the only one here. Babe, I'm nervous. Promise, a little bit. Tiny. But anyways, let me go through my schedule with you guys. So as you guys can tell, I just cleaned up my room and picked out my outfit. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm very proud of this just because whenever you choose an outfit in the morning, it's almost like a game. It's like you never know what you're going to come up with. Like the outfit I wore yesterday, you guys, mwah, I should have wore it today. But also, I really like this outfit because it's giving like, you know, school, cool vibes. <laughs> I'm taking 18 units this semester, you guys, so I have three classes in person and three online. Starting off with my day, I have Psych 4358 at 8.30 a.m. My next course after that is at 11.30 a.m., which is Psych 3210, and then that is followed up by Psych 4260 at 2.45 at the end of the day, and that is just my lab class for psychology. But then I also am taking another Psych 4870 class, which is basically cooperative education. You do an internship, and then we have Art 3618, which is art in the revolutionary period of the 19th century, and then we also have Art 1019, which is basically art in context, but those two are discussion courses, but heavily discussion courses, let me just say that. Because babe, the notes that I've been doing the past few days for my first week, <sighs> wanna drop out, but we're not. Um, anyways, let's get started with my day. We're gonna go get ready and shower, and then I will catch you guys up shortly when I'm headed to school. Okay, so it is currently 8.07 a.m., you guys. I have class at 8.30. My school is about 10 minutes away from my home. So I'm headed to school right now. That is literally what I'm doing, trying to get there as fast as I can, as safe as I can. You know, just trying to do the dash and get there fast. But um, anyways, that's really my main priority. I didn't show you guys like my little OOTD yet, but... Um, okay, let's put the... Let my car drive itself while I'll be vlog. Okay, but good morning. Uh, oh, I'm gonna get there. We're gonna get there. I feel like I look so good. Like the outfit that I came up with while I was like, you know, cleaning up my room and everything. I'm like, but like the best time to choose an outfit. Like, do you guys go to sleep at nighttime, you guys? When I'm going to sleep, I typically think like, what am I gonna wear tomorrow? Like I have school or I have work or I have this to do. Like, what outfit am I gonna wear? Like, what shoes, what pants? Like, you know, what am I gonna put together that I haven't put together before? Always gotta switch it up. So, yeah. But I'm headed to school right now. I'll catch you guys up later after I'm done with my class because I need to focus on driving right now and trying to get there on time. So, mwah. kisses. Back now. Ooh, and the popo. So, you guys, I'm done with class and I'm obviously not at school anymore. I've been running a couple of errands. I got out of class at 9:45. Um, positive psych today. It was actually really good. I actually got ahead on some notes in class. Sorry, I'm like word vomiting and also. I was just like reading so many like powerpoints and slides and stuff and like you know in student note mode that I'm like not at the ability and capacity to speak right now even though I'm speaking to you right now but anyways okay so let's get into the little haul so I actually got more things than I wanted but also I was hungry in class I ate a granola bar because my stomach was growling but I got a Pete's coffee I got a vanilla iced latte with oat milk and caramel ah! This looks so good and okay let's just shake this 
And this is also right up the street from my school because I was at Starbucks, but then also I was in a talk with my workers at work. Long story short, we were talking about how Starbucks is watered down and how everybody is like converting to like local coffee shops or like, you know, local small businesses. But it's also, it's the truth, like Starbucks coffee is watered down. But I did go to Starbucks today as well. I'll get into that as well. So I'm so excited for this. You guys, let me lock my car doors because I do not like people trying to come in and you know, get me. This is so bomb! Okay, and I'm just like, uh, the day's better. The day's better. But on top of that, I also got a double smoked bacon from Starbucks. I've already been munching on this when I was driving here to get my drink, but it's also, Starbucks is literally right there. Bagels and Blenders is right here, so. Mmm. I'm literally just like so hungry and I'm big on if your body tells you you're hungry, eat. So, I was looking at all this stuff. Because this is also my breakfast. So like, it's 11 something but this is like my breakfast for the day because I woke up, got ready, went to class. But also for my lunch from Starbucks for when I'm hungry later. I got a grilled cheese with sriracha hot sauce because I can eat this later even if it gets cold. And then I also got a peanut butter and jam box. Yeah, and that was pretty it for my haul from Starbucks. But then I also did get a maple bar as well for breakfast because this is just so good. And I'm always craving something sweet. But I got my little lunch. I got my breakfast and coffee for the day. And we're all good, and I'm about to sit here and eat. That's one thing I am about to do. And then I am about to go back to school and study, because typically I use my free time to do notes and do, like, materials for school. But... Mm. That's so good. How could I forget the wand? Do you want to show... Hi, Bo. This is 24 Hours with Shay Mitchell. Be prepared. This is a busy day, so we should start with all the drinks. Who are you, Atlas? Elsa? <laughs> I'm happy to say and happy to be back here with the PMP family on youtube.com slash at Jaden Turner. Today we're going to be discussing Pete and Pedro's Revive Black Charcoal Clarifying and Exfoliating Shampoo. This is not like your original shampoo. This is actually like a spa treatment that's going to detoxify, restore, and clarify your hair to the maximum. So if you guys want to have the best hair care for your products, make sure to stop by Pete and Pedro today and shop with them now. And this product is also filled with aloe vera and botanical oats that's going to have you feeling not only fresh, but also just relax you and have you actually feeling like you're at the spa. So grab yourself a spa-like hair treatment today with Pete and Pedro. And a bonus too, if you grab their massage scalp brush along with their volume and strengthening biotin conditioner as well, this will also help reapply your hair to the best and maximum bulk hair that you need. I will leave all the links down below to shop with Pete and Pedro today. <laughs> Good afternoon, everyone. It is currently 1 p.m. right now. I just got out of class, Principles of Learning and Psychology. I'm honestly just chilling outside right now just because my last class did get canceled for the day because my professor went out of town. <laughs> but also, this is time to take advantage of doing notes, getting ahead of the schedule, and you know, getting ahead of the game because we always love that. And that is also my goal of this year is to continue to stay ahead of the game and actually put in my best efforts in all of my school courses. So I got this rain total body feel drink because I was tired and I was feeling very sleepy. This is not a sponsored thing, but this is actually very good. This is actually my second time having one of these. My first one was on Tuesday and today is currently January 26th and the sun is shining and oh my god.
Starting off with the jacket, you guys, I got this top sent to me from a company. Honestly, I forgot the name, but it was sent to me over two years ago. That's when I started my social media journey. Along with this black tee as well, this was sent to me as well from David's Wear. And um, you guys can easily shop their stuff. I'll put David's Wear link down below. I did get the pants right here, these ripped jeans. And I actually, actually like, looped it like two because they were slightly big. And I didn't want them to fall, but like, these are what look like. And then ending with the boots pushing. What's up, you guys? I'm in the library now doing homework. It is currently later on, I swear. I look fake right now. Or my camera's ripped, but I'll catch you guys up. I'm done studying. Back, you know, like, pull your hair back, wear a nice shirt. So like you look presentable, but then also since it is on Zoom, it is just going to be from here and up. So you shouldn't really have to worry too much about like, you know, them saying like, oh, let me see your whole fit. But other than that, I hope your interview goes well. I'm wishing you luck, crossing your fingers, sending prayers, blessings, energy, all of it. And yeah. <sighs> it is 4.08 p.m., you guys. I am so exhausted so tired so 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 tired but i'm not about to go take it out because that's lazy and i hate being lazy i'd rather oh my camera's about to die anyways you guys i'd rather spend my time being productive and doing homework and studying so i could get ahead so i don't have to worry too much right now especially since it is the start of the semester that is my main goal It's 4.15. I'm hungry. Um, so I'm eating my lunch that I bought earlier. Honestly, today was a really good day, you guys. Super chill. Super productive. I might go home. But we also might go work out. That's sounding like the plan. Because question for you guys. Are you guys in school? High school? College? Elementary? How's that going for you? graduate school I was so excited for my first day of school but being an adult and being here on campus with other adults and also this is my hometown as well mm, like it feels like college doesn't feel like college but honestly it's my senior year so like I know I'm in college if you get what I mean but like at the same time Everything just kind of moves so quickly. I'm just like, um, I'm here now. Which I'm excited, but like, it's like the first day of school feeling like when you wake up and you're like, oh, what am I gonna wear? And you're so excited because you're gonna see all your friends. College, same way, but different ball game, most definitely. See this point, I trust nobody, yeah. Out of my body, blowing a fuse out. What is up you guys? It has been a great day at school. I honestly got some energy, woke up by sitting here listening and singing to SZA because SZA! Bring the energy! Bring it! But, um, uh, today was so amazing you guys. I'm just chilling in my car listening to music, singing, about to head home. And honestly, let's do a recap of today. So I woke up this morning, got ready, came to school, had my 8.30 a.m. class. My positive psychology class went very well today. I got super ahead on my notes. I already finished my homework as well, besides one assignment, which I do need to go to Barnes and Nobles for. But other than that, my principles of learning in psychology psych 3210 class was easy amazing took notes of the powerpoint just because i already took notes on the powerpoint slides itself so i was like taking notes on the powerpoint of what my teacher was talking about or when he was like depicting stuff into like smaller informational categories i want to say if that makes sense but other than that my social psychology lab class was actually canceled because like i said my teacher was out of town so i took that time to head to the library i studied as you guys saw and then after that i I went to have lunch. I went to have like a late lunch and now I'm here chilling in the car. Got some energy from singing SZA and about to head home and relax. Um, 
not really relaxed. I plan on going to the gym, like I told you guys. Um, I'm, I just need to go get gym clothes because I don't live at school. Um, I live at home. Uh, and if you guys made it this far, I just want to say thank you for tuning in to my senior year in college, you guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got a little background of what it's like to be in college and be in school. I also work full time and do a whole bunch of other things. And I'm always busy running around. But it felt really good to be able to get ahead in school, get some work done. And yeah, I like this sense of urgency for school. I've been really prioritizing school and putting school first, which I always have been. But, you know, just an even better mindset of that. So... I'm really loving that right now in life and myself. I love you guys, and like I say any other time, remember to be bold, be brave, be confident, and overall bestie, overall bestie, be you, because you're amazing just the way you are. Remember, I love you guys, and I hope you love yourself because you really, truly are amazing. Keep grinding, keep pushing. I'm rooting for you. And that's a wrap! Bye!